Like every year, Pope Francis prayed the way of the cross on Holy Friday at the Colosseum in Rome, a symbol of the first martyrs. The Pope followed the stations very attentively, though he looked a bit tired. Thousands of people participated in silence and listened to the meditations composed by a group of religion students from a Roman high school. They're the same students who carried the cross during each of the 14 stations that recall the Passion of Christ. However, a family from Syria also carried the cross in remembrance of persecuted Christians. Others who accompanied the cross were these nuns from Iraq. Also, this group of sick people, a symbol of all those who carried the silent cross of health problems. When the stations had concluded, Pope Francis read a deep reflection on the Passion of Christ. The Pope asked for the gifts of shame and hope. La vergogna perché le nostre generazioni stanno lasciando ai giovani un mondo fratturato dalle divisioni e dalle guerre, un mondo divorato dall'egoismo, ove i giovani, i piccoli, i malati, gli anziani sono emarginati. La speranza perché il tuo messaggio continua a ispirare ancora oggi tante persone e popoli a chi solo il bene può sconfiggere il male e la cattiveria. Solo il perdono può abbattere il rancore e la vendetta. Solo l'abbraccio fraterno può disperdere l'ostilità e la paura dell'altro. The ceremony was long, it was cold in Rome, and the act ended late. Thus, Shortly after its conclusion, Pope Francis returned to the Vatican to rest.